वेलकम टू द चैनल टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू बी टॉकिंग अबाउट द एल सी आई डी स्टॉक लूसिड ग्रुप स्टॉक एंड इट्स फ्यूचर प्राइस प्रडिक्शन वी आर गोइंग टू बी टॉकिंग अबाउट द प्राइस प्रडिक्शन बाय द एंड ऑफ दिस ईयर एंड फॉर द नेक्स्ट थ्री ईयर आफ्टर अ लॉन्ग आफ्टर एंड अ लॉन्ग टर्म प्राइस प्रडिक्शन इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड थर्टी I think you are going to get an amazing information out of this video. We are uh, we are going to dive down deep and talk and and talk about what Wall Street analysts have to say about this stock in their own words. Where is the stock going from? And now we have seen a huge sell off in the stock year to date, down fifty six percent. we have hit a low of the 52 week low and at $13.25 just last week when is the pain going to stop when is the bleeding going to stop we we have seen this stock plummet and get beat down but it is time now to start seeing the future potential of this company I think you are going to get a lot a uh, lot about of this video before we get down into and get started give me that a big thumb up big thumbs up to keep me alive on youtube smash the subscribe button hit the notification bell to get my latest video uploads uploaded video so guys uh, here we are i can show you how they how they can uh, get incredible uh, deals incredible three stock now without uh, further do let's talk about the uh, lucid group stock ticker symbol lcid there have been a lot of analyst about six that have been reviewing the stock as their primary job would have they, uh, they uh, would have they have been telling us what have we learned about uh, uh, learned from these in an analyst there are several that are being very bullish about this company they are being bullish and saying that in just in the next 12 month by the end of potential of this year this stock can go all the way uh, up to 60 dollar but on the other hand uh, on on the other sides of the spectrum you have you are having a stock analyst that are saying this stock is way overpriced and it still has a lot more room to fall giving giving it at price target of 12 dollar that is huge range but uh, what is the biggest potential in this stock what is the biggest growth factor we have seen incredible downward pressure that we will talking about first uh, uh, we will be talking about what is uh, bringing this stop down it's several factor one being that is supply can issues supply chain uh, issues that is biggest hurdle the biggest accused he he owe for this company but not only is it uh, affecting lucid motors it's affecting all electric vehicle automatic manufacturer worldwide we have seen huge supply chain issue everything from china is being locked down you are not seeing any product coming out of china therefore they cannot build their products so they are not getting that mass production going we also have seen chip shortages on the decline again causing that uh, big big supply chain issue not only this we are going through we are going through one of the roughest time as we have seen just inflation as it as uh, it's 40 year high we have seen the federal government the federal reserve trying to be bring this down by increasing interest rate that are going to be extremely hard for startup companies to raise up money now what are the things that are looking really nice for lucid motors into the future well let's talk about them the first one being the technology lucid motors has the best technology in the electric vehicle market and it is hands down one of the best even beating tesla and if it's hands down one of the best even beaten tesla in its longest range 
in its performance in a luxury all three of those markets the lucid motors is a big best now when will the supply chain issue start cooling down it could be uh, at the end of this year it could be potentially next year but the biggest thing that is going to for going for lucid motor is they have a lot of cash on hand they have a required 2 billion dollar cash on hand that they can use to extend the life of this company in half future growth in mass production in the future i do believe that they will start mass production but it will take a time so if all goes according to plan by the year 2024 if everything goes as planned if we start getting the supply chain issue if we start having the mass production and if uh, the year 2023 the gravity does come out there is a bigger price prediction that analysts are having right now this is expanded to be about 70 to 80 dollar price prediction by the year of 2014 now lastly let's uh, look at the price prediction for the year 2025 and 2030 for the year 25 there are a large variety of prediction out there uh, right now what i have found is that most likely the pre price prediction by the year 2025 will reach the 100 dollar mark if not more based on how this company is going how are the sell going how is the demand going so again it's too early to see how this vehicle and how the sales will be going but i do believe that we will hit that 100 tomorrow a lot uh, sooner than the year 2025 but if we do uh, extrapolate based on the six analysis using that 57 percent growth year over year which is potentially obst uh, obtainable we could have reached the stock price of about 100 dollar by the year 2025 now if we go even further than that the year 2020 2030 and we do have the new exponential growth of the vehicle sale we will have the gravity once these vehicle once these uh, vehicle start getting produced i do believe that we will have this price target by the year 2030 at roughly at about 200 dollar that is again extrapolating these six analyzed price prediction into the future so remember some of these price and less are giving a lower uh, lower price target of that 12 dollar others are giving it a lot higher price target of about 60 dollar i am doing an average and i am extrapolating uh, this using a 57 percent year over year growth for this company that to get uh, these price prediction so lastly I, I did want to end on it uh, uh, what are the things that uh, can change the price of the stock um, moving forward and into the future as there are several factors as we, ha we have just seen most important importantly inflation supply chain issue. They are trying to go green and they are trying to invest with the um, elusive motor group as the company but I hope that you you did like this video. I hope that you did learn something new. Thank you so much for watching. I greatly appreciate it but but if you do like uh, this video give me give me that big thumbs up to keep me alive on YouTube. Smash and subscribe and hit the notification bell. Share this page with your family friends. Thank you guys.